Dude, I think we can I think we can do this. Oh. Ooh, hive mother. Wait, who is hive mother? And Azios the Sky Titan. Wait, who are you? Am I supposed to am I supposed to be killing you first? Who are you? What? Oh damn. I gotta get you. What about you? Hey, that's not too far off. We can just go here and go right over. Cool. All right. Feeling a little better about our copper stores now. It's good. It's more wood real quick. Does wood count? Uh, cutting wood count as harvesting? Anyone know? No, it doesn't. Oh, that's too bad. Armor dropped by mold chest or mold vessels. The round white things in the ground, according to Wiki. Oh. Oh, it's that stuff. Oh, I thought it was. I thought it came off the guys. Whoops. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Man, we're gonna have to make just a fishing chest, I think. Mm-hmm. Oh, wait, let's put this back um, here. Do, 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 do. Munch, munch. Oh, is our pet done? Oh, the close. All right, so let's go back here real quick and do one final push to make sure we got all the little white ball things. Oh, God. And then we're going to go start working towards the Hive Mother. Maybe she has something that we want. I have no idea what gear she drops. So these things? Oh no, I don't think that. Those things. Getting some good skill ups uh, down here if nothing else. It's been a really good combat area for leveling. Mm. Now, do these things respawn? Like the, the little white um, things we're looking for now. Do they respawn over time? I knew the second I got tagged. Is this game good with a controller? I'm not sure. I use keyboard and mouse and it works great.
No, no, uh, dark rack, not the enemies. I'm wondering, uh, like right now, I'm trying to get the mold armor. And it looks like the best chance to get the mold armor comes from the white poofs on the ground, not the enemies themselves. So I'm wondering, do those white poof ball things respawn? Or are they just one-time kills and I should look for another biome kind of thing? Got me. Rude. You don't see any over here. Hmm. Okay, there's a couple up here. is very weird. Um, wait, can I... Okay. Okay. When's Core Keeper Thoughts? Uh, we have a Core Keeper Thoughts, I think, done or almost done. Should be soon. But the, the short of it is, this game's amazing and I strongly recommend it. Yep. Game's awesome. Oh my god, I just... How, you should not be able to power eat like that. Maybe you shouldn't, I shouldn't. Maybe not that dumb. Hey, mold web, web breastplate. There we go. Okay. All right. Is it good? 12% damage against bosses. Interesting. And a lot more armor than the other one. Oh, going to miss that damage, but... And if we can get the last piece, it'd be amazing. Mm, we're going to go for it, chat. That sweet attack speed, we'll take it. A blowpipe. Oh gosh. Being invaded from the rear, chat. Pop a cake. What is a blowpipe? Huh. Hmm. Very good. Not quite what I'm looking for. Splort. That, have I played this before? Uh, I played the early access. Yes. Oh my god, there's so many dudes in there. What is happening in this building?
Or... still a necklace that we haven't even gotten yet it's in here somewhere no idea where oh my god this level is full of hate this really has been like a like a real crawl man this has felt like an old school dungeon crawl oh lord slowly working our way through this place been very cool. Oh, I think this is an exit. Or an entrance. One of them. Okay. Yeah, that's it. Dang, dude, we got so close. Almost had the full set. We need we need the helm. Bummer bummer. Game of multiplayer? Mm hmm. Yep. I guess even get lucky with the uh, fishing gear. Speaking of which, I should probably be in my fishing set. can go this way. I don't think we've scoured. We, we've scoured this area for mobs on this side, but I don't think we went through and made sure we got all the white poofy things. So let's do that. Just to be thorough. Oh, there's one right there, speaking of which. What's that? That's awesome. Um, not what we need, but awesome. Man, there's so many like random drop items in this game that are just really rare. We've killed so many of these guys. So many. And then just randomly got that. Crazy. It's a 0.5% drop rate right there. Feels like it. it. Really does. I'm sure it's not, but. And this warpy stuff really takes the pain out of dying. Hmm. Our playthrough just got a whole lot smoother with this warp. That is for sure. No way. 
Dude. That is... I just happened to snipe that on the way up. Oh, I love it so much. I love it so much. And now we're immune to the mold. So we can actually move around at like full speed in here. So good, chat. So good. I love it. And we get to wear this, this freaking awesome little mushroom kit. Oh my God, it looks so good. Fantastic. All right. Let's drop some of this stuff real quick. Let's get this stuff picked up. We got another breastplate, because of course we did. Um, okay. It's already 9.18. Damn, dude. This game is dangerous. Okay. Uh, let's warp back. Cohen and Shrooms, you know it. All right, so this is how we're going to do. We're going to go over here. Drop off less stuff. Well, first, let's sell real quick. I want you to be like... Here. I gotta figure out what the heck I'm gonna do in here. Because I have no idea. Looks pretty good, though. Um, I, wait, isn't there some kind of, uh... Oh, maybe not. I need the seasonal calendar. Yeah, what is this? What is this thing over here? I only have 27 wool total. Oh my god. I need a bajillion more wool. Stat. Are these things willing properly? Oh my god. That's all they have. Oh, they're out of food. Shoot. One sec. Um, like 70 of these. I think Barry's making a run for it, dude. We're gonna have to do something about that. All right, they're munching. Wait, what? Oh, they're like little sitting things. Oh. Okay. I thought that was like a carpet. Floor pillow. Hmm. Rug. I hope this looks good. I, I wish we had like 20 different types of rugs. Beggars, choosers, something or other. Uh, we're just gonna pick all these up. She looks pretty great. Okay. Hmm. 
Cool. Still need to figure out what we're going to do in here, but eh, I'll figure it out later. Okay, let's uh, go to... I need more dummies. I need more dummies, dummy. Uh, oh. Decorative pots. Well, oh, that could be cool. And paintings. Hmm... Okay. Oh, decorative torches can be painted. So many, so many things to consider, chat. Up with the rest of that. I know I kept the legs and the, uh, the breastplate, didn't I? Oh, maybe I sold them all. Did I sell them all? I am the worst. Yeah, I think I sold them all and broke them down. Cool, cool. Thankfully, I have the Scarlet Bars to make them just for funsies, which is fun. The wool, not so much, though, but I think we're going to start getting more wool now that we're kept keeping them fed, which was a problem before. You happy, Barry? Barry's very happy, full, and producing. problem okay uh we get the merc thing on him for now he got merc pants somewhere else but not a big deal oh we can check this thing out what are you a pheromoth physical range damage and dodge chance well that's cool i like my pet but that's pretty cool yeah, I like that. Okay. Uh, we need a lot more of these. Many, 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 many more. Because we're going to have to make basically a whole new track. Good show. Whoa, Gamer New plays with the 40 gift bomb. Dude, thank you. That's a lot of support, man. Being at 260 gifted was throwing me off, he says. <laughs> well, thanks, buddy. That is, that is awesome. Thank you, thank you. 
Oh no. Okay, so this is funny. For us to properly take this. Oh, we can't. Wait, what? We can't go back? There we go. For us to properly take this, we have to use a drill. We can't do it with our, our normal pick. So we're going to go back real quick. We're going to go up to here. Grab this. Oh no, where's the power? I must, I must have sold it or something. Well, we can bring one back down. No problem. Oh, it's right there. Lol. Never left the old inventory, chat. All right, so now when we go up, we can do this. Boop. Yoink. Oh, you mine now. Mm-hmm. That's right. Now we can take this wherever we want. Big heck live. Co. Hi. I am a soon to be gamer dad. Awesome. When choosing games that are acceptable for your sons to play, what do you tend to look for more so? What do you avoid? Do you just stick to age ratings? Also bongo. Bongos. Oh, well said. Um, so what I tend to do is I tend to look at the game for, first of all, any kind of overt adult themes like blood, gore, nudity, any of that's out of the question. But if there's contextual stuff, then it depends completely on the game. And then I look for things like, does it challenge them creatively? Uh, what is the game going to help them do? Is it going to be beneficial to them in some way? Uh, be it like from, you know, good hand-eye coordination or problem solving or puzzles, stuff like that. So in Terraria's case, for instance, you know, Terraria, if you actually look at Terraria, is kind of a violent game. Um, it's it's not, you know, you wouldn't think that Terraria is necessarily for a younger person with the, especially like Calamity. I mean, it, I mean, it just has straight guns and stuff. But if, you know, if you're playing it with your kid, if you're able to do that, you're able to contextualize everything, have them focus on the parts that really are more beneficial to them, that kind of thing, then, you know, it's fine. So. That's, that's how I see game selection. It comes down to games they can play on their own, which are generally much more safe games uh, that are just, you know, good for mind stuff. Um, games that are, you know, games they can play with you. Maybe those are a little bit more adult or a little bit more, you know, something you can, um, a little bit more, more mature. But again, you're there to help answer questions when they come up. And then, of course, the last category is just adult games or anything that they just shouldn't play. Be it, you know, if there's too much blood or, or way too much violence or something like that. Yep. Those are kind of my three categories. And every game I every game is different. I I, I mean, the, the age ratings and stuff are, are good guidelines, but yeah, every game is different. Mm -hmm. I'm taking this track up because it bugs me to no end if the track is not straight. I want a straight track. I do. It's not it's not straight right now. <gasps> How old before you and your kids start playing EQ together? Uh well, anything that they read is is still a little out of their wheelhouse. Rowan's getting very close. But um especially like reading quickly is not really in the cards right now. So MMOs and stuff. I, w I wouldn't give them MMOs this early anyway. But yeah. I missed the track. Oh, it's fine. We'll go back and get it all fixed up here soon. What's my game of the year so far? I have no idea. I haven't really sat down and thought about it. Not yet. Okay, we're getting close to our horizontal move. Actually, we'll do it right in front of here. Yeah, we'll do it in front of our mine. That'll be perfect. 
Cool. Hey, Blessed Exchequer. Nice. Oh yeah, I I think I think uh, uh, an astute chatter figured that out that we had a copper node that was destroyed by the worm boss. Rude. Unfortunately, I gotta go. I will see you fine folks later. As always, thank you so much for being here. I will see you tomorrow for more fun and games. Have a great rest of your night. It is way later than I expected. And have a good one.